Hey everyone, thanks for joining me. Today, uh, we are testing masks as usual, but we are doing something a little bit different. Normally we're testing masks that we buy on Amazon, or maybe you sent me a mask and I decided to test it, but today we are testing a very special mask. We are testing the $86 million mask that Biden and the White House paid for underserved communities. How do I know this? Well, recently it was announced this company Parkdale Mills secured this contract for uh, these masks. What's crazy to me is that they are hiring like 5,000 people to fulfill this contract. And you have mask manufacturers uh, who are making medical masks in the United States that are being laid off or that are laying people off. Uh, and here we are buying uh, cloth masks, which seems just crazy. So I said, I gotta try this mask. Now, if you go to Parkdale Mills website, uh, they recently stopped selling the mask. As soon as they got the contract, they stopped selling the mask, but I was, able to find it and I got it here in my hands. So uh, I bought it from this place called Comfort Market, Parkdale Mills, three ply washable face mask. I've got it here in my hands. Uh, it's actually very expensive. It's like $11 for a single mask uh, or maybe 10 bucks. And then the shipping was like 10 bucks. Jeez. Comes in a, uh, a regular envelope like this. And uh, when I open it up, it's like there's literally, there's, there wasn't even anything in the package at all. All right, so I'm gonna put this on. It fits really nicely. It actually fits very secure around the edges here. So that's great. It's getting a, it's getting a good fit. Okay, hit it. Go. The $86 million test. Here we go. Final result, 17.78%. 17.78%. This is what happens when a governmental body makes a decision without consulting scientists, honestly. I know like Biden has done so much for the coronavirus, but this is a terrible idea. And we just spent $86 million on this as a country. And we're gonna give this to poor people. I mean, there's something in there that just isn't right.